Good day, good love, and good light, illuminators and way showers. Thank you for joining me in this now moment. My name is Wendy, if you're new to my channel, and I welcome you to all things light language related, ascension, uh, questions about your journeys, connecting with your spirit guides, understanding how we interact with nature and how interacting with nature helps us develop a more deep understanding of ourselves and to know thyself more fully and completely and purely. And I was just guided to share a little synchronicity with all of you. So um, if you know me, you know how I love synchronicities. And today in this blue energy, I was feeling just this need to speak um, clearly speak my truth, uh, invite all of you to speak yours. Um, as often, we'll have it, um, we all are really guided. Um, it's just some of us are a little bit more aware of it, so I wanted to kind of share this awareness with all of you. If um, you're new to my channel, the colors that we are inspired to wear in a day are often a sign and a synchronicity. Um, from our guides to help uh, in may maybe in a particular area uh, to expand on that particular chakra in our body. And uh, I was guided to pull a couple cards and then offer a light language illumination, activation um, to help us all um, open up to this blue chakra. So as I was getting dressed today. As you can see, I'm in my blues and uh, I'm sitting on a little blue table here. And as soon as I came outside, it started to rain. Um, so this idea of when we think of blue, we think of water. Our bodies are mostly water. And so the idea of inviting in also this blue rain water, oceanic water, um, the, just the idea of the energy of flow and blue and in the flow of the energy, um, I was guided to just grab this deck, angels, gods, and goddesses. And the very first card that I turned around was angel of communication. And as you can see, this blue green energy communicate clearly don't be afraid to tell it like it is. And this has certainly been something in my own awareness uh, as of late. And I am, <laughs> I was pretty uh, surprised as I always am about the synchronicity of the blue and the green. Here I am outside in blue and the green. Um, I actually got some seeds in the mail uh, out of, uh, <laughs> just spontaneously, um, forget-me-nots. So little tiny blue flowers, forget me not. So I guess somebody needed to hear that as well. So if we, if we look and there's also filled with symbols. Oh, I guess, I don't know if that's actually coming in very clearly. <laughs> so the green heart energy, speaking our truth from the heart, communicating clearly and saying it like it is. So if there is someone out there who is afraid to speak clearly, to speak what they have in their hearts, this message is for you. And then right behind it, Angel of Manifestation, another deep blue card. So I was also thinking about the connection between our third eye, that deep indigo blue, and when we connect with our third eye, when we connect with our heart, we speak our truth, and this beautiful blue and white energy Angel of Manifestation, your efforts, determination. And that word came to me this morning. Actually, I was working on some light language uh, symbols, galactic artwork, and that specific word came and I wrote it down, determination. Um, your efforts, determination, and perseverance have paid off. So that's definitely a message for me. I needed to hear this from my own guides and angels and goddesses and gods today as we are 
gods and goddesses for each and every one of us is a creation of the same one source which makes us gods and goddesses and then the last one that flipped over was angel of healing and as we can see this also incorporates the yellow the green the blue really all of the all of the chakra colors if you look closely sorry i know that's not it doesn't seem to be focusing very well the angels have felt your sadness and have shown up today to send you healing so yes, I was having my own bouts of sadness today for a variety of reasons. And so all of these cards were simply and extraordinarily synchronistic for me. And again, as I was guided to set up out here and I was actually getting ready to go eat something and something said, just stop and share, share this information, share these cards. So to all of you who need to hear, it's okay. It is okay to, to communicate clearly and don't be afraid to tell it like it is. Speak your heart. And again, the angel of manifestation, your efforts, determination, and perseverance have paid off. And actually, now that I think about it, I think I actually did write the word perseverance as well. I was writing a list of words that were, that were coming to me from my guides. And as I was um, creating the light language art, I'm also deeply activated while I'm creating it. It's quite a, an interesting experience. And so as I'm creating it, I'm getting all of these downloads and information. And that's exactly the words that they were saying today about for, my, for me as well, that my efforts and my perseverance um, uh, have paid off. And it's not, it's, it's about keeping that present, have paid off, not are going to. So if we're putting our, our our mind in the future we're being invited once again to bring it back into the now and to understand that it has paid off already and then the last of course again is the angel of healing and we see two people together your angel is holding you and that was another thing that I was writing yesterday about, uh, I was being reminded that I was, as I was writing angel scripts was, um, I am never alone. And that yes, the angels are always here to help us. They're always helping, they're always helping, um, yet we're reminded that we need to ask. We need to invite um, and appreciate. The angels have felt your sadness and have shown up today to send you healing. And healing really is just reminding ourselves that we're, we are complete. We are gods and goddesses. We have the power within us to feel our guides. And when our guides are just simply here to, to remind us that you're already whole, you're already complete, that we're here to hold and support you when you've forgotten and that we as gods and goddesses and creator beings contain within us already for our body is within our consciousness we already contain within our consciousness the constant connections to source the constant connections to healing to reminding ourselves that we're already whole and complete that we are so powerful that we can come here and forget that we're gods and goddesses, forget that we can manifest, forget that by what we communicate to the universe is what we manifest, and that that is 
what healing is. It's reminding ourselves that we have contained already that power. And I am being reminded of this myself. So these messages are for all of us in every way as they're conveyed through me, the mirror, the reflection, the faucet, the channel, um, just bringing the messages from your higher self to you through this internet consciousness and reminding yourselves that you're always in the perfect state of healing in every moment that I am, we are, regardless of where we are, we're still always wrapped within the arms <laughs> of ourselves, our higher selves, much as as we just had Mother's Day, much as no matter when and where, um, we are always enveloped in the mother consciousness of being held and supported and loved. Um, regardless of what our human experience is, we are always being enveloped in that, that nurturing love and guidance and for all of us to be reminded when we have those moments when we feel as if we're not able to communicate clearly when if we're not um, feeling as if we're completely manifesting or that we're not capable of manifesting or that we have doubted that our efforts and determination and perseverance have paid off. So thank you for sharing this blue energy with me and allow this light language codes and information through the sky, the rain, the trees, the flowers, to remind us that we're all connected to absolutely everything, that you wouldn't be here today um, experiencing this message if your asking um, hadn't brought you here. So as we're reminded, ask and it is given. We are always given the answer for we are complete beings. Therefore, we always contain the answer to our questions. So maybe somebody needs to be reminded it's okay to ask. It's okay to ask. Ask for what it is to... Manifestation is not about bringing something to us that isn't already there. And I'm being reminded of that myself. It's about seeing what is already, already here, that is already paid off. Just smell the rain with me. And the trees and the flowers. The smell of source, the smell of light, the scent of light. Itavianto shi ivaru meala alavkotevo uno omoro uje ikia milava soto visibo oya iki shati samasuvesha akotaviano malava kiato 
borrow shame. Nintiyanda, Totorimboko on Soba, a she ha. Why a kayete kaya? Moyayati nuya ha. Maya kuni. Moya laki shuna hi. Moyuna lo. Mariana ki shayo. I hate you. Nina yala kushunai. Mala shoku. Nina yala lahi. Moyo tu akanya. Male shaki. Moyo nayaha. Moro Cotiva sotto she, Ikaya, not of Yandori in ki plushu, ni kiado ki hai, number to in what on to faka, cashuti shene, preso non be entire. Summer shooti vesanatia, so janoyaya ki, malakoshaya. Allow the beauty and the colors to rise from within you. And speak through your heart, your actions, your voice, your wisdom, your love. The light as you walk through your world. Through the eyes to your universe. Speak, love. No, unte anko ya sapoje inte ki inte vela kota vi supora vishaya. Aji India ki te ki shamore se vishaya. Mono mialo unti ki ise shaya. Zubashono te. It's like they're they're showing me. Yalo koya. Speak to yourself. As you would. Yalo koya shaya. A child, the Arokeba Sonose, nurture your manifestations. Naravelo Kushiati, Sabasuma Sheva, the Untu Supertunga Kia Sonosu. Nurture them by communicating from your heart to your heart through your heart. Allow your solar energy, the creative energy, from the root to the crown. And feel the sadness transform into love into knowing that you are not alone. That I know I'm not alone because of you. And thank you for mirroring your love and your energy and your light here with me, as this is what we are. We are the languages of lights, all of us, everything in creation. As my guides and your guides, the emissaries of the Light Collective, join us today in this now, in this way. We're reminded that they are here to love and support us from all dimensions, in between all realms.
every aspect of creation. Is welcoming, welcoming us here today to share. And I, Wendy, see and draw to me through divine love those beings who seek enlightenment through my process. And the sharing will elevate us both now. And that is a quote from Theo brought to us through the channel Esther Hicks. Thank you. Hello, Kaya Sumoshea. Sumoshlea na keke. Tasanto. Titayano. Akilanto shushe shanakea. Tase. Manaya ti sunaya kashi. Nuye akahi. Naya kaji vashano si atala matisha. I love you. And thank you for your love, your sharings. And it is in divine grace, gratitude, and honor that we meet again. Natoshi.